stunning new twist in the corruption case against U.S. Senator Bob Menendez. This has been tricky, you're right, mm -hmm. because he's denying every charge. There are a host of charges against him, and now we're learning that his wife, Nadine, hit and killed a man with her car back in 2018. The two were just dating at the time. Uh, but prosecutors allege that this crash played a role in the bribery allegations facing the New Jersey senator. Nick is here now with more details. Nick. Adrian, good morning. The accident reportedly backed up by police reports and a dash cam video that we're about to show you. It happened while the senator and his wife were still dating. She was found not at fault because the man she killed, Richard Koop, was found to be jaywalking at the time. But it's what happened in the hours and days after the accident that now has some taking a closer look. And that's your statement that you were driving this way, the guy came from this way, and he ran into your vehicle. He jumped on my windshield. December 2018. Police from the small borough of Bogota, New Jersey, just outside of New York City, can be seen questioning Nadine Menendez, then Nadine Arslanian. It does expedite our investigation when people can help us out. Because if we can clear you from any wrongdoing, I want to get you home and comfortable and not here anymore. The Mercedes Nadine had been driving severely damaged in the crash that killed Richard Koop, who was reportedly just steps from his home. Nadine not taken into custody and not tested for drugs or alcohol. You guys been safe here for the prosecutor's office? Uh, as of right now, I don't believe so. I believe we're good to release her um, as soon as she grabs the stuff from her car. No charges were filed. The failure to investigate Mrs. Menendez in this automobile accident does appear to be a potential cover-up. There was never a legitimate investigation of this car accident involving Ms. Menendez. And I believe we need an outside investigation to find out why the police department did not follow proper protocol. The accident revelations fill in a missing piece in the criminal indictment filed against Senator Menendez, his wife, and three co-defendants. That indictment mentions the accident and accusations that one of Menendez's co-defendants, Jose Uribe, quote, offered and then helped buy a new Mercedes-Benz C convertible worth more than $60,000 for Nadine Menendez in exchange for the senator's help with an unrelated state criminal case against one of Uribe's family members. I mean, that smells, that, that, that appears to be Uribe buying out Senator Menendez to have a prosecutor then go easy on a relative of his. And that is arguably a crime. Now, Menendez and his wife have pleaded not guilty in the corruption case against them involving trading favors for cash and gold bars. Their trial is set for May 6th of 2024. Marky? Yeah, it's the story that keeps on growing new legs uh, for this couple. Nick, thank you so much. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.